YouTube, what it do? It's your boy Rich Eats, and I'm here at the crib right now. But we about to head out and go get something because I was on the freeway coming here uh, about two days ago, and I drove by something that caught my eye. It was a Jolly Bee. Now I'm not sure. I believe it's probably the only one in Houston, or at least around me, by the looks of it. So. Anyway, people, we're about to go check that out, see if this Jolly Bees is any different or tastes any better than the California Jolly Bees, because I'm not too sure where else they have it at, other than like overseas or something like that. But besides that, people, we're about to get out here and get to it. So, y'all ready? Let's go. <laughs> Right, people so we have made it to the Jolly Bees in Texas in Houston and it's it was a far drive it was like almost an hour for me to get here from where I'm actually at but you know I'm here I want to see if they chicken tastes better than Cali's or you know if it's the same or not but anyway we about to go find out that's where we at Jolly Bees here. We got a bunch of stuff. I'm not even sure everything they gave me. Look like some extra stuff in here too. But anyway, let's get into this, people, and I'll tell you if Texas Jolly Bees is any different from you know the Jolly Bee in California. So we got our bucket of chicken. When I smell the chicken, the chicken smells extra greasy. Which ain't a bad thing, it is chicken. But of course, I got the fries. Hmm, let's get the fries hidden. Mmm. Okay. Off top, the fries are way better than Cali's. These are like up here with, I'll say, uh, Whataburger, McDonald's. Oh, look, people. Look at this. They look just like McDonald's fries. Mm, taste just like this. Oh, yeah, and last but not least, I got one of these pies. I forgot the name of it. 
so I'll like put it on the screen somewhere after I look it up. But yeah, I got one of these purple pie things. Never had it. First time for everything, people. Anyway, enough talking. Grab this chicken. And let's get into this, people. So that thigh was pretty fire. Let's see where it goes. One thing I don't like about thighs, it's always like a whole lot of extra skin on there. Now, if you're into like, you know, eating that extra skin, you love that. Oh, it's a bunch of it on thigh pieces. That's why I'm not really into thigh pieces. You get, it looks like it's a lot. Then you start eating it and it's just like a little piece of nothing really covered up in a shell of crispy goodness but all in all people this gravy and that's fire now one thing i haven't done let me try this out take a couple of these bad boys right here swirl them around in this goodness over here mmm Wow. All right, people, I've never had poutine, but uh, this is what it's all about. Good job, Canada. Anyway, now let's go into the spicy piece now. Let's try a spicy thigh. Mm, this one look a lot healthier than the other one. interesting I like the spicy more than I do the original but in California I like the original one more than I like the spicy so I guess it's they really gonna be playing down south no matter where you at what restaurant you go to they know how to bring the, the good spices I'll tell you that all right but well, anyway let's get into one of these legs now see if there's any difference in the legs out, out here and out there. chicken it's fire we're gonna say the rest of this for off camera time so let's put this to the side now i'll tell you one thing about these fries and this gravy like i don't usually do that because there's not a lot of place, places that sell fries and gravy or even if it is i don't think about it but yeah I can see how this could be really good with some cheese. 
some fries. Mmm. So basically, if you've ever wanted to dunk your McDonald's fries in gravy, come here and you can live that experience. Because they taste just like McDonald's fries and the gravy turns it up three notches. Mmm. I can't stop. Fries and gravy. Fire. All right, I have something else. Oh yeah. This thing. This thing I'm a jiggy. Oh, I'm so stupid. I didn't even read the front of it, obviously. This is what I'm eating, the ube pie. All right, so on to this, people. Ube pie, never had it, never even seen one. I don't even know what a ube fruit looks like, or I know what it looks like now, but I sure don't know what it tastes like, and I've never seen one in person, so. Let's see if I made a bad choice by getting this over the wonderful, oh so wonderful, pineapple peach. Mmm, smells like oil, so let's just get into it. Wow, that was disgusting. All right. Wow, that was disgusting. All right. Won't be eating that for damn sure. Let's go back to these fries. Get that taste out. All right. Now that must be a really acquired taste. Cause I just can't do it. I can't do it. I don't even know who said came up with making this a a thing. Oh God, that was nasty. Um, mind you. This is like right by, I believe, the downtown area, they'll call it. But I'm, I'm not sure. I think this might be the only one in Houston. But we're here. And their chicken is pretty much, it pretty much tastes the same. But they do, they do their spicy a little better than California spicy. And their regular is just so bland. It's like they don't put not even a drop of salt on it or something. It's just deep fried in oil. And that's all you taste is the flavor of the oil. But all in all, the regular pieces is good. And also the, the spicy. So eight one for the spicy, seven nine for the regular. Yeah, because the regular just didn't have any flavor, really, so can't give them the same score. Nope. Oh, the frogs. These are 10, people. These are 10 when you add the gravy. Mmm. 10. Uh, as far as that pie go... That ube crap, 0, 0. 0.0. I wouldn't recommend that for All right, nobody. So anyway, that's another review. As always, thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have subscribed, just hit that like for me. You know, trying to get my subscribers up. So keep them coming. And you know. And I'm going to keep the videos coming. And they're going to get better and better from here, people. So stay with me. And we're going to do it. Till next time, people. Deuces.